Let's take a look at date calculations on the HP 12C calculator. So it can give you the date that is 100 days from a certain date or 30 days prior to a certain date. It can give you the number of days between two dates. And those can be actually kind of useful. For example, you may know that um, the close of your fiscal quarter is September 30th and you'd like to know how many days that is from the current date. Or perhaps you are leaving on vacation on July 1st and you know that your final payment has to be made 45 days before the departure date so you can use the date calendar. So this is actually um, pretty useful if you're using the Black-Scholes option pricing model. You may know when the expiration date is and you'd like to be able to count the number of days so you can figure out the fraction of a year it is so that you can use the uh, Black-Scholes formula. So here are some of the keys. Oops, sorry. Under the number four key, and you have to hit this light blue G function key, it says D.MY. That's the um, day dot month year format. Okay, so you're going to type in the day um, and then a dot and then the month and the year. Underneath the number five key is the m.dy, the month, day, year format, which is uh, much more common in the United States. The date function, and that mdy one is under the number five. The date function is under the chs key, and the delta dys is under the EEX key. The date function calculates the date um, and day past or future that is a given number of days from a given date and it always uses the 365 day calendar. The delta DYS key calculates the number of days between two dates and it includes leap years and there is a way to switch it so you can count it based on 30 day months but and I'll show you how to do that when we do um, a couple of examples. So let's take a look here. All right, so let me bring my calculator back. Let's find the date that is 100 days after January 1st, 2021. So I'm using the month, day, year for, format. So I type in, sorry, I got to turn it on my calculator. Let me clear it. So you put in 1.01. 2021 and you hit enter and then you type in 100 and then you go to this date key and it looks funny here but it's telling you it's April 11th 2021 and this 7 here tells you what day that actually is okay number one is Monday number seven is Sunday so it's going to be April 11th of 2021 and that happens to be a Sunday you could also um, here we can find the date that is a hundred days before January 1st 2021 so again I'm going to put in the date the same way 1.01 01 2021 enter and I'm going to put in a hundred and I'm going to change the sign to negative and then again I'm going to hit that date key and we see that it's um, September 23rd of 2020 and it happens to be on a Wednesday right uh, number one is Monday two is Tuesday so three is Wednesday and let's find the um, number of days um, between June 1st, 2021, and September 15th of 2021. So let's see how we do this one. It's 6 dot 01 2021, enter, okay, 9 dot 15. 2021 and we're going to go with the delta days so 
that's right here, and we get 106 days. So that happens to be based on the actual number of days. If you actually use this XY swap key, it turns out it's 104 days based on a 30-day calendar. So this is kind of a useful, although probably um, neglected function in the HP 12C calculator, but something that comes in handy, you know, for the Black-Scholes formula or finding out how many days until the end of the quarter.